So the first of the big grade one events is the Ferdinand Dufoy Noves Chase. I should really have Martin here. He pronounces the French much better than I. So two mile five furlong grade one chase. Art teacher for Leon van Rensburg. Master of Shadows, Josh Sutherland. To Moyne Block for Craig Allen. William the Conqueror for Leon van Rensburg. Fergus Falls for Darren Thompson. Caliani Flip for David Robertson. Northern Life for Kevin Minahan. The Long Pools for Josh Sutherland. And the Young Ones for Craig Allen. Make up nine. Star has already got him away. Plenty of group racing this week. I think 24 out of the 43 races have been set up for the big boys. So they've got plenty of chances to see who can win the championship. Not too sure who's the leader. Let's get back to this race. It's William the Conqueror of the Long Pools and Art Teacher together. As so we come down to the second, it's William the Conqueror that leads them over. It's his swing left hand, as you can see, they're a little bit wide here on the course. So might lost a couple of lengths, so it's William the Conqueror that leads. About four, it's Art Teacher in the Long Pools, his stable mate, and the other side is Northern Life. We get to the third, nice big jump there by the leader. Poor jump towards the river, to Moyne Block, gave it plenty of air. And it rather slowly, but it's this William the Conqueror leads him to the fourth, takes that one really well as well. There's a mistake there by Cagliani Flip as he went through the top of it. So some of the jumping a little bit sticky towards the rear, but it's this William the Conqueror is conquering all at the moment and jumping very well as he goes over the fifth. So William the Conqueror by about five to the long pools, more than life out wide. Our teacher on his inside front through one master of shadows and Fergus falls and Cagliani flip between horses. Better jump there by two more block and himself a length advantage. And the one that's shuffled right towards the rear now is the young ones. It's about three lengths off the chasing pack as we come inside the final two miles. So William the Conqueror has a quick little round. Always stable mate went through the top of that one and shuffles right back. Allowed the long pause and all the might to take the second and third together. So race left handed now and it's William the Conqueror still leads by three to the long pause and all the life length back to our teacher up against the fence and we've got Cariani Flip and Master of Shadows wider still as Tamoyne Block back again towards the fences with David David oh, Fergus Falls and then the young ones just to the rear. Wall bad mistake there by Fergus Falls, Mr Thompson. So with a mile and a half left to go, it's William the Conqueror that still leads, jumping really well. Comes into the ninth, so they don't have a ten to take, and still this William the Conqueror. Cagliani Flip has now moved up well into second, bring along Tamoyan Block. as Northern Life and the Long Pools just have a little bit of a rest. Our teacher just catching up as well now. Master of the Shadows just at the tail of the pack, and then just in the rear, a couple of lengths off the pack. The young Ones and Fergus Falls. They go over the water. It's William the Conqueror that still leads, but he's leads down to a couple now from Cagliani Flip taking a hold to my block well running on well on the outside. And you've got Northern Life and the Long Falls and Art Teacher. Master of Shadows, Young Ones and Fergus Falls is now bringing up the rear. So, with just over a mile to go, it's still William the Conqueror that leads. So we're off out for another circuit. The Long Pools moves up into second. It's to my block, Northern Life and Cagliani Flip just to have rest as they go into the 12th, the leaders over it well, although it was a little bit slow, kept on landing, allowed the long pulls to get within a length, Northern Life comes up to join as well as Cagliani flip, wide still is to Moyne Blood and Arm Teacher, and then the three of Master Shadows, Young Ones and Fergus Falls all got back into the pack now, as they go over that couple, then we've lost one, it's the long pulls that's gone, couldn't do the double fences very well, so we come down to the final six furlongs, it's William the Conqueror, on his own still by about four to Cagliani Flip who's now second on his own and further three back to Fergus Falls Northern Life Art Teacher Master of Shadows Young Ones and Tamoyne Block as they go over the 15th and it's still William the Conqueror by three to Cagliani Flip coming out of the pack now is Fergus Falls who hasn't jumped particularly well as he gets to the big hedge and they're all over that and it's still this William the Conqueror going to conquer everybody here as we come down to the final half mile been leading since the beginning whips out now as the jockey on him to go inside the final four. So it's William the Conqueror over the 17th with just two to jump. Leads by five out of the pack. Here comes Fergus Falls, an art teacher. Cagliani Flip hasn't asked for anything yet. Running on really well as Northern Life. Young Ones has got a lot to do. The two are not going to win from there. A Master of Shadows and Tamoyne Block as we line up for the jump.
judge with just two to take it's William the Conqueror from Fergus Falls trying to close the gap stable mate Mark Teacher for Leon trying to make also make up ground so with a quarter of a mile to go it's William the Conqueror that gives away to Mark Teacher and Fergus Falls but does he he fights back against William the Conqueror with a third and a half one to jump William the Conqueror is a little bit slow and Fergus Falls and Mark Teacher jump it better Fergus Falls comes out of nowhere and it's Fergus Falls William the Conqueror fighting back on the inside Fergus Falls William the Conqueror William the Conqueror gets back up William the Conqueror from Fergus Falls William the Conqueror deserved to win this and he's gonna he's gonna take the Ferdinand Dufair novice grade one chase well done to Leon van Rensburg like he might have just lost it there to Fergus Falls he had plenty left starts for a little bit more and takes it from Fergus Falls in second Cariani Flick was third fourth was Leon van Rensburg's stable mate which I can't remember the name now. I'm going to say Winter Hawk. No, oh, it's not called Winter Hawk. It's called Art Teacher. It was fourth, fifth was Master of Shadows of Josh Sutherland.